On this episode of Travels with Bill, we take a quick peek at the newest town to get a radio station. We're in Esterhazy, Saskatchewan, home of CJ Radio's Easy FM. Esterhazy is a water tower town, and at the top of the water tower, you can find a brand new antenna. That's where the signal for the new 99.5 FM originates. That's our fifth radio station and first station in Saskatchewan. Esther Hazy's listeners joined the existing 100,000 people in the fall of 2021. It's been a bit of a journey to get this station going. COVID got in the way of a bunch of our plans, so there's been a lot of adjustments. But better late than never, Esther Hazy now joins the CJ Radio family. Estrazi itself is a great town. It has a nice business section with a couple grocery stores, a Red Apple, Tim Hortons, and a bunch of unique local businesses. Of course, if you've heard of Estrazi, you already know it's the potash capital of the world. You'll find about 3,200 people living in Estrazi, but the area is full of mining activity, and there's lots of small towns nearby with even more residents. One of the things that always strikes me about the town is the can-do attitude of the people I meet and the amount of pride they take in their community. There hasn't been a time that I've visited Esterhazy where I haven't been impressed with what I find. We're flying over the business section on a Sunday, so things are a little slow, but check out how clean and beautiful it's kept. Esterhazy still has angle parking, so it's super easy to find a spot when you come to visit and check out the area. If you need to go to a big shopping town, Yorkton is the closest, but almost everything is here already. Given the mining activity, you'll also find a fairly new hotel, along with an A&W at the edge of town. At the end of the street, you'll find Potash Pete along with the Esterhazy Flour Mill, Museum and more. In the fall of 2021, the new playground is just being installed and kids all over the place are excited to get to try it out. Once upon a time, there was a railway line here and you can still make out a bit of where it went. The flour mill is one of the oldest and it's nearly complete. For a small admission fee, you're able to take tours when it's open for visitors. We're going to spend a lot more time exploring Esterhazy in the future, but on today's episode, we're just giving you a bit of a peek so everyone out there at our other radio stations can see the town. When we do the longer version, we've got much more to share. Three potash mines are close to town. We're looking at the K1 mine. It's by far the most impressive to see, though it's being closed in favor of the newer K3 mine. A lot of people from Esterhazy and all over the area work in these mines. Esterhazy is also very close to the main CN line, so of course there's some great train watching to be had here as well. Like the town itself, there's much to learn about the rail lines in the area and the mines. We'll be featuring those topics on future episodes. For now though, we're going to wrap up our quick peek at Esterhazy and get back to putting the finishing touches on the brand new radio station. Farewell from Astrahazy, and I'll be meeting you on the new Easy FM morning show very soon.